Alright guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video. So, we're gonna do a video on the second uh, category that you can run uh, here for the Beerus Dokkan Event Burst Mode. Um, it seems like the 6,000 points to get all of the missions done um, is really not that tough for Burst Mode. I, I, I know you can make it as hard as you want to, but I do think maybe they should increase the, the sort of like minimum difficulty to get all of the missions done. I, I, I do think so. But, you know, again, we, we could do like a challenge run where we up Beerus significantly. So we have Join Forces selected. Uh, we're going to use STR and physical type characters. And it's an insane lineup. I'll show you all in a second. Uh, 500 team cost. Um, I made Beerus immune to everything, but of course, you know, stunning him and stuff like that could be a very viable strat. Um, I made him have the 50% damage reduction against int characters. We will not be using them. Uh, then he gets the 15% less damage or damage reduction, whatever. Uh, and then attack, defense, HP, um, damage under 100,000 does zero. Uh, minus three key from everyone and then no items. So I did this because, I, you know, I was like, oh shit, like we could, you know, use Super 17. Super 17 to me just seems like he's going to end up being one of the most unfortunate releases of the year. I I, I feel like, I, I mean, I don't want to say this, that, like people are going to get so mad at me, but like, I feel like they can't really fumble harder than they did Super 17. And I know I said this and people are going to get so mad when they drop some even worse Dokkan Fest later out of the year, but like, I just can't see how they could possibly fumble a character harder than Super 17 this year, especially in comparison to God Goku. Who, these units are released two weeks apart, right? Now, again, we're using Joint Forces, STR, and Physical. Now, this is significantly different on Global NJP, right? We have the 8th Anniversary LRs, who are, you know, STR and Physical Joint Forces characters. We, of course, have um, Super 17 as well. Um, actually, if we look at it, our line, like, Physical STR Joint Forces, there is a lot of interesting units here. You know, perhaps... What if I got rid of... Hmm. I do kind of want to use the Vegeta and Bulma since they're pretty new. Uh, I think I'm going to get rid of 17 and Golden Frieza. And I'm going to bring in 16 and 18. Because uh, they could work very effectively with our Super 17 characters. So let's go ahead and jump in. I don't think we'll have any difficulties. Um, we probably won't even be able to transform into Super 17. But we'll see. Um, now remember, Super 17 is a character that has a bunch of just very annoying restrictions, like terrible, awful, horrible restrictions where you want to be using, wow, that sucks. You want to be using extreme class characters and you want to be fighting super class enemies and stuff like that. Uh, we will be able to uh, do battle with super class enemies. Hopefully super 17 does not get sealed right here. Perfect. That's good. Um, let's do this, I guess. Sure. Uh, we'll, we'll just put Vegeta right out there in front. Doesn't really matter too much. Uh, remember, in this opening phase right here, we just have to make sure that we attack Beerus. You, you can't attack Whis at all. Whis dodges literally everything. So we're not going to be able to get our hands on Whis. All right, let's see what Vegeta does with the counter here. Uh, okay, uh, not really too much. And he gets super too great. <laughs> yeah, terrific. How much does he take? 100k Vegeta! Oh my god, dude. Vegeta's not even a burst mode character, man. <laughs> no! That Vegeta and Bulma, are you kidding me? Oh my god. Now, remember that Super 17 does stack attack here. So, this unit is going to be getting stronger um, as they're doing more supers. Also, uh, do keep in mind that they do... Um, uh, so, they stack attack with every super attack they do. But they also get a guaranteed additional super against Beerus, right? So against Beerus, we do have that guaranteed additional super, which is going to be good. Good, 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 right? All right, so they're going to get supered, and they're at double digits. Wow, they actually got hit by it, too. Because, remember, they, they get 17% per attack. No, 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 no. No, why would they? No, don't seal them. Come on, you piece of shit. No. Don't seal them. That's so stupid. No. Oh, all right, man. Ah, uh, annoying. I, we, oh, oh, this actually is good. This, this, let, let's try and avoid same type of orbs. Yup. 
Oh my god. Dude, we ha- we ha to get the Super 17 transformation. Okay, so we gotta make it a real point to not heal from this point forward. Um, Whis actually did us a huge service here, I feel like. So, okay. Remember, it's- for Super 17 to transform, it's turn 5 and under 70% HP. It's just, we have to get through multiple turns, dude. Oh, it's so diff- it's- it's so difficult to transform a Super 17. I still don't know what they were thinking with- with his uh, transformation condition. Okay, okay, okay. If we get double Super 17 now, that would be so sick, man. That would be so sick. Okay, okay, so let's- let's give them the STR keys first again. We- we can't heal. We don't want to heal, so I want to avoid same type orbs. Yeah, see, we're not doing that. Uh, Vegeta and Bulma, whatever. You're just getting tossed off into the garbage pit. Um, okay, super attack right here. This is fine. This might do a little bit of damage. <laughs> there we go. Might do a little bit of damage. It might have done a tiny bit of damage, unless they were guarding. If their guarding was procking, they certainly would have been okay, but you know, it, it's fine. I, I am noticing, too, so when I did the verse mode, we, we did it Legendary Existence. We're using the new Dokkan Fest God Goku. And it's just like, we were tearing Beerus in half. And then we get to here, and it's like, I just feel like we're not really doing much damage. I could have made our team even stronger and brought the Dragon Ball Z, uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. I didn't want to make it with too many, like, you know, 8th anniversary characters. I'll just spam them. I mean, yeah, guess what? That unit is way too good for burst mode, and so is the uh, GT Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta and, and GT Goku, right? Like, yeah, the, these units are above burst mode level for sure. Like, you know, I, Beerus, like, built up with most of his buffs. Like, these 8th anniversary characters would probably be good there. Um, okay. So, let's put you right here. Now, remember, uh, Goku and Piccolo, we want them to get hit a bunch. And then that would allow them to, um... We'll do this. Uh, Goku and Piccolo getting hit a lot would allow them to use their active, right? Which I, I, I think I, I would like to get in the video. I, I don't... I haven't done their active very often. That's what can... You know, like, burst mode... Like, kind of like things like this can be fun sometimes. Because it's an opportunity to use some of these other characters I haven't had an opportunity to use a lot, right? Get some of these, um active skill sort of setups and stuff like that uh just sort of get a lot of those right so that's uh that's good right um all right well let's uh go ahead and see what we are going to do right here um i i, I can't wait to get this active skill with evan that yes that the super 17 transformation now this is also a fight remember it, it's just preposterous uh, how Super 17's um, sort of like active skill works, right? Or, or it, uh, not his active skill, how he has to get hit um, by a million, billion, billion, zillion um, normals, right? Uh, he has to get hit. W what does Super 17 have to take? Uh, 10 attacks in order to fully build up his defense. In burst mode, we could actually probably get that. We could have Super 17 get hit the full 10 times and fully build him up. I think LR Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, um, they should go ahead and finish off right here. Uh, we should be able to, yup, yup, perfect, and then there we go, nice, 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 nice. Then get some stacks in. Yeah, we're, we're gonna be able to pummel Beerus with active skills. We're gonna have Goku and Piccolo, we're gonna have, um, LR Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. We have several that we're gonna be able to go ahead and drop down right here. Okay, so here, uh, okay, I guess... I mean, 16 and 18 might be a little bit scary. Okay. I, I would like the other uh, Super 17 to be able to transform as well. So, again, I want to try and not get same type orbs. We're not below 34%. So, Super 17 is not going to give us the uh, um, scouter um, on this right here, unfortunately, though. <laughs> All right, so now we've got a, now the unit is uh, is super dominantly looking good right here. We we are cooking now at this point. Okay, okay, okay. 
So let's definitely make sure to get them in slot one right here. Um, we are going to have a couple of links. Oh, we could get GT up as well. Uh, let, let, let's not do that, though. Okay. Oh, actually, I don't... Hmm. Oh, this is so annoying. I would like the GT Goku and Vegeta to get a lot of key. They, well, okay, so 30, 40, 50. We're 50. I want to stay below 70%, which we should be able to easily do. That's a super attack for them. And then they can get... Oh, yeah, perfect. And then they easily get... The, the thing about the 8th anniversary LRs, they are so crazy for burst mode, right? This this doesn't do damage. Oh, right. No, no. Oh, no, he doesn't. <laughs> Wait, all right, hold on. A lot happened. Right, yeah, he, he absorbed it. We are below 70%. Um, I got very fearful for a second there because I was like, oh, my God, he's going to heal us over the threshold. We're not going to be able to transform with the other 17. But no, because his healing mechanic sucks balls. Right, it's so terrible. What well, it's he, he absorbs 34% of the damage he would have taken, right? Which is like it's so specific. In order to heal from that, like you got to be hit by like the spirit bomb in like the 8th anniversary event or like I, I guess AGL Dragon Ball Super Broly, right? Like in Red Zone, like that. That's it. Like the those are the only things that are actually gonna do significant damage to this guy, like in, in most situations. Because like perhaps you know, like maybe like in Omega would be able to do some damage to him, maybe. But that in Omega always supers in the same spot after Super 17 with Super Attack, so it wouldn't really work that way. So I don't know. Yep. And then here this unit goes. Go go. Remember that they permanently stack one key every time they super attack, making them, you know, them and the DBZ Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, they're like two of the best burst mode characters in the game because their key mechanic, their infinite stacking key mechanic is working to counteract that, like, you know, negative key we give to characters. Um, I, I still can't use the Makunkin Sampo. No, what? All right, well, we can't use the Makunkin Sampo, whatever. Uh, unfortunately, too, I don't really want to... Uh, like, you know, Vegeta and Bulma, like, yeah. I, I'm a, This video is about Super 17, not Vegeta and Bulma, so tough. Just, you know what? Tough, tough. They're, they're just going to have to deal with it. We, we got to let Super 17 look good. This is his show, not Vegeta and Bulma. Although, Vegeta and Bulma, if we got a lot of crits right there, that unit could have done decent damage. Although, do we think they would have done more damage than Super 17, though? That's the thing. Like, w w all those counters, would they have done more damage than what Super 17 is going to potentially drop? Additional Super? We do get it. Yeah. No, the answer is no. Like, there's no way that Vegeta Bulb was doing more damage than this. <laughs> uh, remember Super 17? He gets a 30% chance to crit um, just from his passive. For f Oh, what? Oh, but he's goaded. He's too good. Wow. Two key points. Oh my god. What a behemoth. Super 17 is crushing here, man. <laughs> I love it. I, lo I love this. I love this. This is so good. Yeah, Super 17. Go. Go. <laughs> All right, man. I am uh, surely enjoying this quite a bit. Um, okay, okay. Uh, do we want to transform here? Actually, well, no, wait, wait. We could link fairly. Yeah, they do link fairly well. GT shot. Like, look at this turn for Super 17. That's the thing. Um, remember, one thing to not be forgotten. I feel like a lot of people would overlook this. GT is a very strong link. And it doesn't really differentiate between, oh, you know, we must use these super class characters or these super class characters, these extreme characters or these other extreme characters. Like, this is a pretty strong link. Two key, 10% attack and defense. So, you know, there's some stuff we can make happen. Let's um, go ahead and transform into LR Super Saiyan 4. Go Actually, no, 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 no. We won't transform into Super Saiyan 4 GD yet. We'll, we'll save it. Next turn, he'll be able to use his active. That's what we'll do. Um, I am going to give them all this key, though, so that they can, you know, get a little bit more build up. Uh, I'll save the physical orbs. Uh, 16 and 18. I don't... I, this Beerus is not going to kill them, right? I would feel so stupid. What if we fully built up Super 17? He needs to get hit so many times. What were they thinking? Why does he need to get hit so many times? 
Even in like a ridiculous burst mode, we can't get it done. Please, man, what is this nonsense? All right, Sue, oh my God, look at this beast. He could do one more. He's got one more in him. Go ahead. Damn, that's a normal. Still pretty good damage though, right? It's doing a lot of damage. Still not built up. Still not built up. Still not built up. It's impossible. Can't be done. <laughs> like, you actually have to do, like, such shenanigans to allow him to get hit. I know people could say, like, oh, they're, you know, buttering us up for super long content, right? There's going to be the new legendary freeze event that's going to go 50 turns long. But, like, do we actually think that's coming? I, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm not so sure. I mean, they, they certainly could make other types of content and they could do something like that, but... Um, I don't know. I, I feel like if that was going to happen, um, it would show up, right? Okay, so, uh, here's Super Attack on them. This isn't gonna one-shot us. Oh my god. Oh, that was so close. Are you kidding me? We actually almost got one-shotted. What the hell? He really supered at the end. Yeah, this, okay, okay. So this, um, 6,000 points really isn't that bad. We lived with 2,000 HP. Hmm. Um, how much damage is the Mkunkan Sampo gonna do right here? This is a very interesting. So we're gonna go ahead and transform um, into the Goku and Vegeta. We're gonna get the support, and then I'm gonna pop the Mkunkan Sampo. Uh, we're gonna do some really, really nice damage right here. So sure, let's let's do all this, all this uh, shenanigans. <laughs> Pretty good damage right there, for sure, for sure, for sure. Uh, okay, so Piccolo healed us when he we swapped into him. Uh, will we die here? I mean, we're, we're gonna finish with the spirit bombs. What's gonna happen? Yeah, sure. Let's uh, let's do this. I kind of wanna get Piccolo. L l let's let Piccolo get some shine. We might not even die, actually. I, I don't know. Let me just get this uh, Piccolo um, <clears throat> animation in here, because I, again, I, I feel like I have not used this Piccolo and Goku very much uh, recently at all. Um, and yeah, th this really wasn't so bad, right? I'm, I'm actually pretty surprised 16 and 18 lived that attack. 13 by him. Yeah, he, he can hit hard. This guy, this Piccolo can hit very, very hard. He does have a, yeah, an attack nullification as well. Um, not enough damage. No, we're, we're, we're actually going to live this turn, I think. Unless Vegeta gets supered. I don't think Vegeta's going to die. Um, so we could have LR Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta finish with his active skill? Maybe. Oof. I don't know. Maybe this is kind of a bad... No, because now we're... Oh, no, but it's a, it's a guaranteed crit. Huh? Oh, my God. What? No way. <laughs> All these rare things. Wow, we got the Rage by Rage Vegeta. Okay, sure. I could see the Big Bang. Yeah, Burst Mode is where we could actually get the, the Big Bang attack, right? It, it's, like, not possible unless you're in Burst Mode or, you know, doing, like, like fighting, like, a Kid Buu Dokkan event or something like that. The Big Bang is when he's, I think it's seven key or less. Yeah, right here. Like, you, you can't do this unless you're, like... Because on a proper leader skill, he starts at 7 key, right? Okay, that didn't kill Beerus. <laughs> okay, sure, man. <laughs> That's all right. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're totally good. Because now, we have this. Yes, sir. Easy. This was fun. I, I did have a lot of fun doing all these animations and stuff like that. I love winning with, like, 4,000 HP. Beautiful, beautiful. Absolutely incredible. Hmm. 
ルージョンするぞカカロットルージョンしてっておめえの口から聞けるなんて最高だぜベジータルージョンああ俺は孫悟空でもベジータでもない俺は貴様を倒すものだいよいよこの俺の必殺技を見せてやるかこれであの世へ送ってやるウルトラビッグバンカメハメハWe go lovely. Yeah, burst mode can become an active skill showcase, I suppose. Sure, 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 sure. All right, there we go. Burst mode. I do enjoy burst mode. I'll probably try try and get like some nasty high score. Maybe I'll I'll go for like you know a seven thousand score or something like that. Uh, make a video out of it. I don't know. These could be fun. I, I think utilizing like some of these eighth anniversary characters, we could do real shenanigans in here to get an insane score, right? So there we go. Um, let's go ahead and accept the final mission right there. There's all the burst mode missions done. Thank you guys for watching. I love you guys, and I'll catch y'all next time.